What up everybody, it's me Blake316 and I have an exclusive to show you guys. If you guys don't know, I'm really close with Microsoft. You know, they know me personally. They recently sent me an Xbox One. They constantly send me some of their exclusive stuff before it ever comes out. And basically when they sent me the Xbox One, I got my hands on the Xbox One dashboard. So what I'm about to show you guys is an exclusive in-depth look at the Xbox One dashboard and what you have to look forward to in the future of Xbox One gaming. Now I just take my Xbox One controller, let me just power it on for you guys. Basically what's going to happen is when you go to the dashboard, this is what the Xbox One dashboard looks like. You know, because they always refer to TV and sports. So what they have here is sort of like a channel guide, an on-demand, you can search for, you know, games and whatnot. It even shows the weather at the bottom. But let's see what the channel guide is on the actual Xbox One. As you see, there are tons of options of games, I mean TV, to watch on the Xbox One. Because when you get your Xbox One, there's going to be plenty of things to watch. I mean play. I'm sorry. I'm getting my, my words uh, confused here. If you want, there's plenty of sports on Sports Center. But if you want to go on other channels, you can uh, obviously see all the TV shows. You even have, may not, there might not be many games, but there's definitely game shows like Wipeout on the Xbox One. People, I'm telling you. When you get the Xbox One, there's going to be plenty of TV and sports to watch. This is just a quick in-depth tutorial of what the actual dashboard will look like for the Xbox One. I actually have to go right now because as you can see, I got a long day of gaming, I mean TV watching, ahead of me. It's me, Blake316, just showing a quick in-depth uh, preview of the Xbox One dashboard. Until next time. Peace.